There are always moments when we do spectacular speaking. One stands out in particular. There was a woman who attended, and I was speaking with her this morning before, before the day really began. And she'd come to spectacular speaking on the understanding that she would not have to speak. She does not like public speaking. She didn't want to do any of these speaking exercises. And I said, it's fine, you don't have to, but think about it because here, spectacular speaking, we, we look at it as a, a speaking laboratory where you can try things, where you can take chances, you can take risks, and even if things don't work out, nobody gets hurt. Well, as the day went along and people were giving more and more speeches, this woman decided that, okay, I'll give it a try. And she gave a wonderful, wonderful speech about who she is, what she does, about an important turning point in her life and why, why that's important to her and what she's doing now. And it was remarkable and big applause, lots of great feedback. And for me, it's when she came and sat back down and she, as it turns out, she was sitting beside me. She had a smile from here to here and I leaned over and I said, aren't you glad you did this? And she said, oh, I'm really glad I did it. Thank you. And so that was a very, a very poignant moment for me at this year's Spectacular Speaking.